come to some of the most awaited topics from geography and economics expected for your mains now here we are also focusing on the topics for your optional as well right so along with the gs optional again some of the very important topics india has been witnessing a shift in india's demographic dividend and that would come true by to uh, 2100 and where we would have higher number of aging population now this shift and its impact on to the economy would be a very important topic to discuss then the recent lithium discovery we have already covered a separate lecture on to it the potential energy security and energy sources that india now has uh then another important uh, concept in terms of energy is green hydrogen again green hydrogen hydrogen clusters we have covered a separate lecture uh green hydrogen besides green hydrogen one is the types of hydrogen that we have covered in one of the classes then uh besides green hydrogen electric vehicles uh lithium ion batteries how they have been role changing or we could say have been uh, creating an impact on to energy resources and energy conservation uh, so extremely important in light of bipper joy now this is one of the questions that we have provided for your essay writing competition as well answer writing competition as well this time now in light of bipper joy uh, you need to focus on disaster resilient infrastructure in india the ndma guidelines propounded for cyclone management the weather forecasting and the predictability for the various cyclonic events in india the next important topic is deep sea mining so under deep sea mining uh, we have to specifically focus in the resources for indian ocean so what are the important resources under indian ocean which have been um, available through deep sea mining so the polymetallic nodules is one very important development similarly besides this we also talk about another important concept which is seaweed farming so another important farming with reducing land because of climate change a shift in the farming practices where seaweed farming is another important topic heat dome a extremely important topic lot of uh, regions in united states have been witnessing this idea of heat zone heat dome uh, we have again covered this in a separate class uh, al nino the weather changes and reduced rainfall because of al nino al nino and la nina and the enso which is the southern oscillation and its impact the indian ocean dipole are some of the other important topics so uh, in the video lectures we have covered those in detail one very recent development extremely important for geography and geology students this time is the change in the earth's tilt and that is being caused because of the extensive extraction of groundwater similarly other important case studies for you uh, include uh, for the included for the climate change is the chiti lu river and this river lies in mizoram this river has been drying in the recent course of time the recent wildfire which happened in canada had its impact on to new york and how people in new york were forced to use n95 because of the extreme air pollution caused by forest fires in canada so again global and climatic phenomena has become important another important development that you need to understand is the melting of hindu kush now with the melting of hindu kush it is believed that the waters in the river basin would decrease by 2100 and the idea simply is that lot of glaciers have been melting so ultimately by 2100 we would see reduced amount of water in the glacier bodies also one of the recent developments in light of environmental concern one is cop28 and the other is project chita so project chita another very important development this time for environment and gs perspective the next is coming on to the field of economics 
One very important topic this time is inflation. All the terms, crooks and cones related to inflation. Inflation, deflation, disinflation, hyperinflation, stagflation are some of the terms you must be familiar with. Besides these terms, you must also be familiar with certain effects being caused by inflation. For example, lipstick effect, which we have covered in a separate video. Neo banks, what are those? The recent HDFC and HDFC limited merger uh, creating it one of the largest banks in the world uh, the impact of India impact on India's toy industry because of the Chinese toys coming into the market then uh, then one question we already had last year which was related to gig economy and gig workers again this topic is extremely relevant and important for this time but in light of the social safety so how gig workers or gig economy would generate their social safety or social security so what would be the ways out for them is another uh, brainstorming topic then india to join the critical mineral club Again, an extremely important topic and with the rising prices, reducing purchasing power, declining food imports, uh, what would be the impact on countries which are already vulnerable or facing acute food crisis? For example, African nations. So what would be the strategy for them and what could be a good way to protect the country from uh, these kind of burdens is to shift to alternate farming practices. The farming practices which are lesser dependent on the uh, imports and also which are lesser um, dependent on monsoon. So a climate resilient crop could be a good option. And there we talk about millets. India is celebrating, uh, UN is celebrating the International Year of Millets 2023. So millets, a uh, poor men's cereal as it is called as is again a very very important topic you can consider it from the perspective of economics or geography or whatsoever extremely important for this year another important topic is spices the indian spices how they had been a game changer during the covid pandemic and how uh, even foreign nations are relying on the various spices and their therapeutic approaches is another important aspect among tourism one very important topic this year is eco tourism so those are some of the important things that we have touched you must cover every nook and corner of these topics uh, before your exam starts. So wish you good luck and have a wonderful day. If you have any questions or queries, feel free to connect back.